I seriously could not believe that cove. Well, this is not a good sign. Foggy again. Not a good sign at all. All right, everybody, I am back at Castaic. I cannot stay away. Um, as you can see, there's a little bit of marine layer still, a little bit of fog, um, but uh, it's not bad. There's a little wind out there too, but I just hit one of these coves to start off and hopefully I'm gonna get on some fish. Feels like another trout. Followed it right up. Tell by the head shakes. See? You let go. Thank you for letting go. Got another trout. It is. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah. Ridiculous over here. Ridiculous. Packed with trout. These trout are huge and they're biting everything. I mean, look at that. I'm just reeling in the Sanko and I get hit on the way up. Oh no, it's the uh, Kytec. Kytecs and Sankos, man. These trout are just demolishing them. <laughs> That's how confident I was that I was gonna hook a trout. They are just aggressive over here. Good size trout, man. These trout are huge and they're biting everything. I seriously could not believe that cove. It's right the cove right before Trout Point. I guess they don't call it that for no reason. That place is packed with trout. It was almost every single cast. I must have caught 10 just in like the 30 minutes I was in there. Back to back cast, anything I was throwing Sankos, Kitex. Crazy. Yeah, there's a bass. Flying. Kind of glad. fish too. Not bad fish. Not bad, not bad. Wow. 
What is this? Really? Smallest bass in the world. <laughs> Baby smallmouth, yeah. Well, uh, aside from the first cove with all the trout, uh, I've caught a few bass here and there, again off deep points. Uh, that bigger one, I mean, maybe two pounds, two and a half, um, was off a point as well. So I'm going to try a couple different places early this time instead of my, in my usual routes. <laughs> He's good. All right, I uh, just got off the water. Uh, it was a good day, lots of fish everywhere, nothing over two pounds once again. Um, it's tough out there, man, to find any quality fish. Uh, I caught like 10 trout uh, as soon as I got there, like literally it was like 10 in a row. Uh, one after the other, almost all of them on Sanko, a couple on the Kytec, I could see them like chasing it. I mean, they were so aggressive. I saw this other boat uh, get here and they had their limit of trout too. So. If you want to catch a lot of trout, now's the time to come down here because they just stocked thousands of pounds over a couple of days. So there's tons of them and they're good size, man. Over two pounds, you know, nice chunky fish, maybe even bigger than that. Anyway, that's it. Um, it was a good day. I'm still waiting for the, the big bite, man. I'm waiting for some, uh, some good sized fish. So I'll probably be out in a few days, maybe next week. Other than that, see you tomorrow. Try to get a... Oh, that's a giant, dude. Oh my god, this could be my biggest bass ever, dude.